Before we go, I have one last story that might make you smile. This is what I'm liking. We talked about our love for books, something many of us share. That also includes a Utah woman who went viral for creating mini books. Check this out. Was it absolutely necessary to make tiny replicas of the books that I've read over the last year just so that I could put them in a jar and have a visual representation of my own accomplishments for my own validation? No, no, it was not necessary. Do I regret spending two and a half hours of my night last night making them? Also, no. They are my favorite thing, and I regret nothing. Oh, my God. She needs a show. She's so funny. They look adorable, and after the video went viral, her inbox was flooded with messages asking how she made them, and probably just as many saying how funny she is. We have Stevie on the line right now who watches on KSL TV in Salt Lake City. What's up, Stevie? Hi. You, I have to lead with, yes, this is such a cool idea, but you are so funny. Your comedic timing is on point, ma'am. Thank you. <laughs> so so where did you get the idea from? Well, you know, I'd, I'd seen a similar trend with uh, Christmas ornaments, and people were tracking the books that they had read, uh, like in a Christmas ornament. And it was, it, it inspired me because I have this kind of silly problem where like only half of the books that I read are like the physical book and the rest are digital or um, audible. And I know that that's a hot take and that some people are gonna say that doesn't count as reading, but it is my jar and it counts. And they go in. <laughs> but this was like, this was the perfect solution for that, right? Like I could have my audible, audible audio books, my digital books, and nobody knows the difference. Uh, so that's where I kind of got the idea. Um, but I, I played around with the design. I, I figured out how I wanted to make them. And then I spent a night and a, bottle of wine uh, making them. Uh, I made uh, a little over 20 of them, I think. Yeah. Uh, and I've, I've added to it since then. In fact, we have a we have a new um, we, we have a new addition to the to the jar. So yes, Karen Slaughter's the Perk, the Netflix series now. Hi, highly recommend. Fantastic book. I love that. I actually love you read The Dutch House and The Midnight Library. I love those two. I read those as well. I was trying to, I was peeking at all your books while I was looking. Thank you so much, Stevie. I'm liking your post right now, but I'm loving you. <laughs> That's not all. Our season-long partner, Pilot Pen, makers of G2, the go-to pen of the Kelly Clarkson Show, want to honor ultimate overachievers just like you, ma'am. So they're going to be writing you a check for $1,000 just because we think you're cool. <laughs> 